from the Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. All right, so this is a reading on Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho. I have a subscriber that purchased this reading and wanted to know um, what the energies were between them were, if they were dating or whatnot. This reading was purchased a little while back and I've been so busy, I work shift work. So sometimes it's really hard for me to get caught up on, on my readings and so I'm now caught up and uh, so this is something that she has purchased and asked me to share it with everybody out there. I hope you guys enjoy the reading. For any of you out there that are new to my channel, a little bit about myself, I'm a clairsentient, clairvoyant. Um, I do readings. I love doing, I, I do energy readings. I pick up emotions between people. Um, I read their energy. It's called reading people. That's what I like to do best. And um, if you would like to purchase a reading, please email me. My email will be below. I have two services that I offer. A full reading is $65. And uh, you get you can ask as many questions as you like and I will read until I'm finished. And the other reading is one question, $25, five cards. And um, so the turnaround time is seven days, less than seven days, okay? Uh, so uh, this reading here, uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. Now I know that like I was kind of doing this reading here and I know he's a little bit younger than her, but I think that this is a really nice connection here between the two of them. Okay, so uh, for those of you who are um, uh, subscribers, I thank you for coming back and subscribing and watching and supporting my channel. I'm so really grateful for each and every single last one of you. And, um, you know, uh, thank the subscriber for purchasing this reading and allowing everybody to watch it. So, all right. I hope everybody enjoys the all reading. All right. So you want to know if Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho are in a relationship or a secret relationship. She's a, she's a Scorpio. She's 36. He will be 30 next month. He's a Sagittarius. I like this relationship. I do feel that they're in a relationship, some sort of a relationship. Um, he is younger. He's, 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 she's going to be 37. He's going to be 30. So there's seven years between them, but I don't think they care. Um, there is passion here between the two of them. She was with G Dragon or people thought she was with G Dragon or something like that. But, um, I don't think that's, that's over. That's done with. I don't know what's going on there. I think that's over with, but Sandera Park and Choi Minho. Yeah. I feel like there's something going on here. Um, they're very passionate about either the work that they do together. Um, I don't know if they work together, but yeah, I do feel that there's something going on here between the two of them. I do feel like it's a secret relationship. I feel that she's in control. They're both very passionate. He's fiery. She's very deep and she's emotional. I feel that this makes a good couple. Okay. All right, so Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho. Here's the cards. I hope to be able to shuffle underneath here. The way I do my card readings is I shuffle till one card falls out. Those are clarity cards and jumpers. If more than one card falls out, I put it back in the deck and shuffle till the one card falls out. All right, so what are the messages regarding Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho? There's the first card. Two cards fell out. We're going to put them back. Second card. Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho. There's the King of Cups. cards fell out. I'm going to put those back. Okay. 
This is the Five of Swords. Now, the very first card here is the Five of Swords. This card talks about someone who's very powerful, intentional, they're quick acting, they're a leader. This is uh, about um, the King of Swords is about uh, ambition, decision, order, justice. This card stands for Mind, Power, Decisions, and Justice. So it talks about them knowing what they want. They're very decisive and there's no questions asked. They both understand what they want in this relationship. Okay. Then we have the Ace of Wands, which talks about a new romance. This is about a new beginning. Aces are beginnings, tens are endings in a tarot in tarot cards. This is about passion between the two of them. This is a new beginning. This is romance. This is work related. I don't know. Uh, I really feel that they're very passionate towards each other. Um, this card stands for beginnings, decision, drive, desire, ideas. Uh, it's a symbol of uh, commitment from a male partner. He really likes her a lot. She's hard to get and I think he I feel like he's won her over and um has chased her and there's a lot of passion here between the two of them then we have the king of cups so the king of cups is very tolerant empathetic uh I feel that they're very uh they can pick up each other's thoughts they're empathetic they understand each other um, sometimes it, this can be a little bit of a energy of being a little bit cold, but, um, they can keep their emotions balanced. This card is saying that their emotions are very balanced and it's, they're very empathetic towards each other. Now we have the four of wands, which it's a minor marriage card. This talks about stability. The four of cards, the, the number four in tarot is stability. So I feel like there's a lot of stability here in this relationship. And you can see there's a child here. I don't know if they're going to get married and have children, but there is a potential of marriage and having a child, just one child maybe between the two of them. This is about celebrations and families. I don't know if they've met each other's families or not, but this is about celebrating together with families. And then we have the Five of Swords, which is about fighting and protecting and defending what you have. You can see here this person um, is winning at whatever the cost is and will will keep what is going on here because they this is that important to them to have this have this stability in their life. Okay? All right, there you go. That is the reading on Sandera Park and Choi Min Ho. I hope that this reading, uh, you guys enjoy it and this format was good. All right, thanks again. Bye-bye.